be laughing at. You got a bag? You want me to get it? You want me to be your bag? Where I go, Spider Man. Spider Man, Spider Man, Spider Man. Fighting, fighting. By the way, Spider Man is Spider Man. Mind you, yesterday, or last night, put the white feet on me, I was watching the live feed of that Eastern Brown Hope on where his face was injured. And Jensen had not seen it, obviously, as we broke. And he sat up and went, Ethan Brown. Oh, so and he knew. Oh. He's going, oh, jeez. So face. This is really cute. I think he actually said it on the band aid. To know the, uh, I don't know if it identified them. Knock, knock. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. How are you doing? I'm good. Oh, there's a card. There's a card of yours. Waiting for it to go because we thought I mean, everyone we spoke, he said it'll move on. It'll move on. Most of the time, they do, but, but it's just kind of like it's uh, child proof. It's, it's just kind of uh, decided it doesn't want it. Ah, uh -huh, see, it makes me feel better. You can use the dog door. <laughs> <laughs> you reckon my belly can get through that? Your head may, but about it. Bangor, yours wouldn't have um, appreciated. No. This guy eat that cat easily. Would he? Yeah. Well, they've got chops next to it. Rats, mice, chops, cats. If they've got anything. If they've lost the chook and anything, no. Oh, it's not fed. It's not fed. No, 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 no. That's just its belly. If it, if, if it was fat, it'd be a lot. So, why is it kind of found this as its home? I'm not too sure. They're an arboreal snake. Usually they live in your ceiling. Okay. It's not shedding. It's, it doesn't have a belly full for it to be having a nana nap. Look at his pupil. He's full on watching you. We've been away for a couple of days and we came back on Sunday and it was here then. So I don't know if it arrived over the weekend or. Or it could have been here for a day to even. You know, look, I don't know if it's even noticing. Yeah, uh, you can catch it. So. Is he? Big, up, oh, they get to double this. Yeah, oh, really? Yeah. Oh, what would he weigh? He'd be watching a little bit snappy, I think. He'd probably weigh five or six kilos. I've caught them at 13 kilos. Oh, Watch your kilos. face, Mum. Because. <laughs> yeah. your phone? Where is your phone? In my pocket. These guys, they have about a hundred teeth with no venom, so if he gives me a nibble, I will lose a bit of blood. But he's, it doesn't bother me, it's just blood. He is actually quite calm, but I'm being very gentle with him as well. Is that Hope Island again? You getting a lot of snakes at the moment? Yeah, with the warmer weather, they're all more active, so. Yeah. Cold blooded animals, they do better when it's warmer. Mm -hmm. so. yeah. For this guy to be this big, he's rather old. Okay. He'd probably be looking at about 10 years plus. 10 years, okay. And if all goes well, they can live up to 40, they say, but that's usually snakes in captivity. Yeah, okay. And then what do they get attacked by? Like snakes or what? No, the, it's more so people, dogs, okay. humans. Shovels, cars, d uh, Shovels. <laughs> destruction of their um yeah. their habitat and whatnot. So there's also the rat baits, um, oh, okay. foxes, cats. That's a lace monitor has been hit, clipped by a cone, pines. Yeah, I thought it was Hope Island. No, they don't want to wait. Uh, 
know, say, well, good luck finding somebody that knows what they're doing with a lace monitor. Anyway. <laughs> Come on, you big fat bumper in here. I'll dump him back in a minute, no doubt. So what is he about, the two metres? Oh, we'll stretch it out and have a look, Brooke. Yeah, it'd be an easy two metres. Probably a tad more. Yeah. So Will Brooke be, what, 1.7? I think I'll 1.7 or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, it'd be two, two, two metres. They get to easily, the biggest I caught was 3.3. Right, okay. But at that size, they're a monster. They look massive. Yeah. Well, he looked big when he's wrapped up. He's just thick. Yeah. Well, he'd easily be able to eat that cat in there. Yeah. Yeah. Without even trying. Just disengage his jaw. Yeah, disengage his jaw, yeah. So where are you going to take him? Oh, we've got a... Uh, well, we've got a handful of snakes to release yet, so he, he can go with them. Okay. I was supposed to release him earlier this morning, but I never got a chance to. Any idea why he's coming here? Statistically, one in three houses have them in the ceiling. Yeah. They're very, very common. Yeah. The chooks nearby is one of them. Um, I don't know if you let your cat outside here, if the cat hangs around behind there but they can go 12 months without a feed, so to sit there and wait in a spot, but he wasn't in hunt mode, he was in sleep mode, to sit there and wait for a rat or a mouse or possum, whatever it might be, to come past him, but why he was here, I have no reason. Because okay. we've never seen snakes around his tail.